Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm here with my wanna swap wife, Laura. I'm here with my drawingly good husband, Nathan. And we're here to take, I guess, a look through it, a flip through of the Dinosaurs Swap It Series 1 collection. This is, I'm thinking from the 90s, I collected these as a kid. Um, so it would have been somewhere mid, late 90s. It doesn't actually say on the outside of the folder and I can't remember for sure. So Apologies. So they're, they're dinosaur <laughs> trading cards, if yeah. you haven't guessed. Um, but they didn't come in like a dinosaur trading card pack from memory. These were like one of those weekly or fortnightly magazines, um, magazines and things you could buy. Uh, and the idea was to obviously have fun collecting them, but also to learn about dinosaurs. I so, love dinosaurs, so I was I was quite happy to do that. <laughs> so they're actually, they're quite thin. Let me see if I can get them out. And these are not the same size as a regular they're trading not. card. They're a little bit taller. Yeah, they're a bit taller. Um, they're pretty thin, and you've basically got uh, the thing of a top trumps, I believe, that plays similar to. Plays? It's well, not it's, a game. But you've got the attacking score, defensive score, special combat score. Well, I don't remember getting anything about it to do with the game. I mean, I'm sure, you know, that's probably I what I thought what I for, remember was with top trumps, it's whoever had the highest number or something won. It gives you a very small description and how to pronounce the dinosaur's name. Yeah. Uh, so there was like commons and rares. Yes, I which we do two. have. So you can see they're all numbered. Obviously, there's a custom that you can Pockets. buy when the set came out. And, so this uh, is a yes. super dino, and it's um, shiny on the there and there. Yep. Apart from that, it says super dino. I think these were the rare ones, if I recall. Yeah. Um, so they're just scattered <clears throat> throughout all of the pages. So you'll see a few more as we kind of. I like the artwork. It's all hand drawn, but it's it's just yeah. very nice. I like these because <clears throat> I like dinosaurs. Um, and I like learning about them. I know, that may sound really nerdy for a kid, but that that was the sort of thing well, I was and, interested in. And my in. dad <laughs> saw me take saw me. My dad took me to see Jurassic Park when it first came out when I was like four or five. Good times. I very, saw it at the cinema when it came out too, and I was definitely not the age for very it. Very appropriate. Now I went for my cousin's birthday. I thought it was great. <laughs> Tell me, why are these ones green on the back? Um, I don't know. Maybe it was because they were the herbivores, I want to say, maybe? You know why that makes sense? The Velociraptor is a carnivore. Yeah, I'm not sure. Because there's n this is all I have of the set. I don't know whether there was anything else that originally came with it. Like, information about the set Supplementary information. Yeah, Let so us know. I mean, I'm sure that we weren't the only ones to collect these cards when we were little. Presumably not. So, this is something that I think we have the whole set. I can't even remember. Uh, we, we kind of just pulled this out and we were like, let's, let's do a video I think, on I think, this. Is there two series? I'm not sure. I only ever had series one. So, why is um, one of the blue ones? I don't know. Maybe they're the omnivores. Hmm. That makes sense to me. <laughs> That's what we're running with, unless someone tells us otherwise. They look like cuddly little kitty cats. These were a really big thing um, when I was a kid. Not not this set in particular, but... One of the purple ones, or I, pink I, ones. I don't know. Now they've lost me. <laughs> um, they were very yeah, popular back well, in the day. What I was going to say was, the, you know, the things you could buy every second week or, you know, every week, and there was, like, a new edition. You had to build a was set it, of it, something. Was it Degostine? Degosta? Degostini does yep. a whole bunch of them. And they're still mm. around today, but I feel like they were bigger when I was a kid. I also had uh, Little Ark, which was about animals. Um, and they had like fact files. There was also one of these that you actually built a dinosaur. You got like the skeleton pieces. I remember all those, pieces. yeah. Yep, I had that as well when I was a kid. I Ooh. don't anymore, which is kind of a shame. Recent discovery. Now these are super rares? I think so. <laughs> so the actual whole dinosaur is actually shiny. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, it says new discovery. Mm hmm So very cool. And there's uh, almost a whole page of those. And they were all together at the end of the set. Um, and that is indeed the full set so of 96. What I would like to know from this video is from any other people that had these, tell us what, tell us anything about them. I'd be interested to know. Yeah, I was obviously a kid at the time. So aside from <clears throat> collecting them and that they were cool <laughs> to me, I don't know anything else. I'm, I'm so. almost positive there was a second series. 
I never got them, so I, I, I couldn't say. So let us know any information. We're curious. We thought we'd share it because it's something that we don't really hear anyone talking about these days. I mean, you mean no one's talking about dinosaur swap cards from the mid-90s? I know. Oh, jeez. Unbelievable. <laughs> if you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know down below anything you can tell us about these because we're intrigued. And uh, did you enjoy having a flip through if maybe you'd never heard of them before? Good puss puss. Uh, wrong creature, perhaps? <laughs> <laughs> Hit that subscribe button and check back next week. We've got another video coming then. Sounds good. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.